Today I will teach you how to put stackhorned fern on the plate. Full of useful information. You can collect it and study quietly. Because this lemon is crooked. I'll aeroplode it today to correct it. This is the correct way. So the old nutrient leaves must be cut off for a more beautiful life. Don't feel sad, keep some old nutrient leaves. The nutrient leaves have the function of storing water. Let's start take good notes. Soak the moss in boiling water and spread it out to cool. Prepare a piece of plastic film. A small ceramic basin and a hemispherical mold film. Primer facilitates final demolding. Put on the small pottery pot to reserve planting space. Fill the gap with water. Be sure to use force when pressing hard. Repeat this action while filling this phagna moss and compacting it. Just press it to this extent. Find a suitable board. Screws on both sides for easy fixing. Remember to leave some space for tying the wires. Demolding time is up. Wood chips is base coconut shell. A little more sphagnum moss. A few slowly fertilizers. The bud point is positive when it is towards 12 o'clock. Fill the gaps around with sphagnum moss. Fill it up a bit. You can start tying the wires now. From bottom to top layer by layer. Don't tie it too tight, use less force. Press down the old nutrient leaves and fix them. It is more secure if you pass it from under the old leaves. Just one last one. Tie a knot. Use your hands to roll it up to make it rounder and firmer. Use scissors to trim off any sphagnum moss that has grown. Staghorn fern successfully moved into a large flat. Enjoy it. Have you learned it? I didn't learn to watch it again.